Hi, I'm Tim Neubauer, and this is your Safety Moment. Back again at Associated Scaffold. Today I'm gonna to talk about one of the harder concepts to teach uh, scaffold users and, and scaffold competent people. It's, it's the capacity of the scaffolding. Uh, it's gonna get a little complicated and do math off the top of my head, but I wanted to start off with a couple of basic, simple premises. Uh, I'm gonna hold this yellow tag up here and so you can see that it says uh, loading schedule and you have a choice between 25, 50, or 75 pounds per square foot. So if we take uh, 25 pounds per square foot and we look at this, and I'm gonna go over and use this walkboard as an example. Uh, a walkboard is seven feet long by uh, uh, 18 inches wide. So, so I've got uh, seven by uh, 18 uh, inches, 1.5. Seven times 1.5 means I'm about 275 pounds uh, for 25 pounds per square foot. Uh, that's just approximation math. So 275 pounds, and if I was to put two more walk boards on that floor, then I'd be up to uh, uh, six, uh, 700 and, uh, uh, um, 725, 750 pounds per, for a deck level, okay? 750 pounds divided by four legs uh, works out to uh, 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 less than 200 pounds per leg, so we're great, because these legs hold about 2,000 pounds. So, but when I put another level on there, I've got the weight of the scaffold plus that deck level, and now my capacity per leg is just doubled to 400 pounds. And then when I put a third deck level, now I'm up to uh, 600 pounds. And when I get up to nine levels, and I'm talking 1,800 pounds, now I'm getting close to the capacity of each leg. Um, so you've got a couple of choices. Don't deck every level because it's the surface you're standing on. If you have five levels deck, then you've got that square footage. Uh, so. Bear in mind the weight of the scaffold and the surface of decking, you have three uh, criteria, 25, 50, or 75 pounds per square foot. I'm Tim Neubauer, and that is your safety moment.